What's up, you guys? I got some messages for you. All right, so I was trying to get some more positive messages because the messages here lately have been kind of annoying to me. <sighs> okay, so I said, Spirit, I wasn't even going to get a lyrical message, but I did after I pulled some cards out because I was thinking like, I'm not, I don't even want to just start pulling the cards out and it's another message about some ex, obsessed ex or some crap like like, you know, the collective is moving beyond this. Okay. Come hell or high water. <laughs> okay. So the tower here with this lightning, what I want. So I got this, I pulled the cards first. And then after I pulled all the cards, I got, um, I went ahead and tried to get a song for y'all. And the song that came on was, this is what you came for, Calvin Harris and Rihanna. And she says, baby, this is what you came for. Lightning strikes every time she moves and everybody's watching her, but she's looking at you. So that's pretty interesting. All right. So let's see what's up. Okay. So big happy changes coming like in the next six months. That's the question I asked before I started recording. And as I started pulling the cards out, I was like, okay. Where are my rings at? I feel naked. I don't have my no nails or rings. Okay, we ain't worried about that. Okay, so the first card that came out, like I was saying, the first cards that were coming out, I was I was like, okay, spirit. I was asking for a positive message for the next six months, and what I'm getting is still annoying me. But it's not. Let's see what's going on here because I think I can save y'all some time to get to the good stuff that's what spirit is trying to help me to help y'all with right now helping you get to the good stuff because you do have some good stuff coming here with the two of cups and the magician you're manifesting something beautiful here okay now that's coming at the end so the thing is like i said as far as uh saving y'all some time i think there's a decision that could be made right now that could save you a lot of time and really turn things around because if you don't make this decision here uh it's just gonna take longer you're still gonna get there but it's just gonna take a lot dang longer with the hey man that could be a long time of stagnation kind of being stuck in the same you know type stuff so with the two of voices and the two of swords the two of voices is actually the same as the two of swords. So it's really talking about something that you don't see here. Okay. A decision that needs to be made here next. And we got Pisces energy with the hangman. Next, we got, um, death and rebirth with the four of swords, death representing Scorpio and the page of Pentacles. Now, what I'm getting here is that ending something with a, a connection that you've got going on. This could be something about a friend, maybe with the Page of Pentacles. Y'all give me one second. Um, so I'm sorry, I was just I, my daughter texted me. Okay, so what I'm getting here is that you can make this decision. The lovers coming out, which is a Gemini card, is another card about decisions. Well, it can be. And I really feel like if you make this decision a little sooner, it's all up to you how fast you're going to get to, you know, this beautiful energy here at the end. Okay, so making a decision here um, to end something, I think. I believe with this Four of Swords and the Page of Pentacles, you could be dealing with somebody who's kind of immature, excuse me, uh, that I was getting this energy of, you know, so this could be a friend or a love situation here. Let me see. What kind of cups here? There's not a lot of cups here at the, these uh, in these top rows. Cups represent emotions and love, and I feel like that... It's getting to a point with a situation where you're, it's draining you at this point. It's draining you at this point. So the thing is, you could make this decision to end it. I think that um, 
this is a situation with whoever this uh, person, this connection that you have with somebody. It's like this back and forth thing where just when you've started to heal and you're like, okay, I'm, I'm going to just move on here. That's when something happens that draws you back in, uh, or should I say drags you back in? Um, <laughs> okay. So it's, it could be this, I'm getting this thing where you start getting, um, synchronicities and stuff. And you're like, maybe I should, you know, maybe I should talk to that person or maybe I should work on this connection or whatever it is. And so you go back, you know, you turn back around, you go back, or maybe you even go back to the thought process of why did it happen like this? You know, something like that. And, um, all of it, this whole situation is really bringing you into this energy of strength here, which is Leo energy. And, something beautiful is coming out of it. It's, it's forming you into like who you were always meant to be. It's like you coming out of your shell here with the just, with this justice card, um, Libra energy. So then we got the two of cups and this magician. So I want to look further into that. This tower card though, with the lightning, I think that, you know, you may be in this energy of something has ended and it's really, made you sad it's put you in this energy of kind of depression or sadness and i think that you know changing your perspective on the whole situation is going to speed up this process a lot um with the lightning i do feel like a lot of times the lightning to me it means that um spirit the universe god whatever it is you resonate with uh there was a an outside force that protected you from something is what i'm getting here so <clears throat> let me see what else i can find out but the two of cups represents um a soulmate connection so we got the four of cups at the bottom of the deck and the four of wands you could be seeing four 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 or two 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 give me one more second you guys I'll be quick. Um, okay, so, but what I'm getting here is that there could be a, there could be like a situation where, hmm, that's interesting. Okay, there could be a situation where, you know, you're, you could possibly miss a beautiful opportunity here because you're, like that, the song, everybody's looking at her, but she's looking at you. It's this energy of you have all these opportunities around you. Like this car right here is even giving me right now. There's so many fish in the sea. There's so many fish in the sea and you could be overlooking one here because you, you are focused on, you know, the, Maybe the orange and white fish that looks like you or the black and white fish that looks like you. And it, and it don't have to be looks like you, you know, just different things. And then you miss over somebody over here. That's a different kind of fish. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> okay. But uh, I don't want you to miss that opportunity because of whatever this is here. Of course, everybody heals in their own time and everything, but... This is the message I'm getting here. There's a lot of frustrating energy in the collective right now. I almost was like, you know what? I'm just not even going to, I'm going to wait till this, whatever this is, blows over. But I'm going to keep going. We got the sun here, Leo energy with the two of cups again. Wow. You, the judgment card. Okay. You're definitely being protected from something here. So whatever ending has occurred, it was because you were being protected from something here that maybe this person is getting into or going to get into, you know, whatever the case may be. Uh, two of Cups again. So with this six of pentacles coming out and all these two of cups, it's going to, it's like the big happy news that's coming in in the next six months is that you're going to be around somebody or some people. The two of cups can be about soul tribe, soul family. It don't have to be about like a lover's type relationship or it could be. So, but what I'm getting here is that you're really, um, 
what's going to be coming in for you is like this soul tribe energy, uh, friends, or, you know, maybe a special person or something, but that's what you're manifesting. The six of pentacles is about equal energy, this equal give and take energy. So this is, this is going to be a situation where somebody is going to be giving you as much as you're giving them. It's not going to be like this energy of all they do is take your time, energy, whatever it is. Um, one second, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so... This card always reminds me of the Titanic. All right, so for some of y'all, this person could even end up getting into some kind of legal trouble or something, or, you know, that's not for everybody, but just, there's just something that, um, something that you're going to be getting, uh, energy that you're getting away from because, you know, they're just, they're not putting in the time and effort or energy, whatever it is that you're putting in. So this could be a group of friends. Like I said, it could be whoever it is, you'll know. It's a situation that is making you tired at this time. Or you're tired of it, you know, but you, like I said, this person keeps drawing you back in. And they're kind of, yeah, they're kind of getting in the way of something else that the universe is trying to bring you. All right. The emperor with the two of pentacles. with the magician and the three of pentacles definitely look even this card here the five of pentacles taurus energy it's like this energy of uh she's throwing all this energy to him 12 12 on the clock and he's over here like with his head buried i'm getting um this energy of uh manipulation here <clears throat> and i keep getting that and it's really annoying the crap out of me it's like this person took you down a rabbit hole. Um, and they're very convincing, conniving, and um well, convincing, like I said. So the thing is that they try to get you to wait on them like you're uh <clears throat> like you're what is it, Snow White? Who is the one who has to be kissed by the the prince that's like she's asleep sleeping beauty, not Snow White. Sleeping beauty, yeah. So they just, they put you on hold like an elf on a shelf. Or, no, uh-uh. No. This could have been going on for a long time. And this is that. It don't it don't have to been going. It could have been going on for six months, six years. I'm seeing 13, 13 on the timer or, you know, whatever it is. It's, it's been going on for a little while. And this two of wands, this card always makes me think of a... Uh, Something that you were protected from with this temperance card, which represents angels to me and ancestor spirit team. They try, they are removing this person from your life because, or they're trying to, ultimately it's always your decision, but they're trying to because they can see what's coming. They know what's coming. Like, and it's, it's some bull crap because only because this person is just on a, they're on some bull crap, whoever it is. So, <clears throat> all right 13 minutes okay so i'm gonna uh i'm gonna keep putting these messages out until whatever this is is cleared <laughs> okay because it just keeps coming through basically in different ways all right so i'm gonna get some from the believe in your own magic deck and we're gonna move on to the next one i may get some from the sacred forest too universe we are all just stardust. Number 31, which is which breaks down to a four. Somebody's birthday is coming up. Shark, swim away from this situation. Number 35, which breaks down to an eight. This, for some of y'all, this could be about a work situation or something. But most of, most of y'all, it's... It's about some kind of really, you know, connection that you really were deep into. 
um, gray. Endings are inevitable. Number 37. Do you see the lightning back there in the clouds? You're magical. You're very magical. Take control of your own narrative. Number 22. Library. stars you can manifest your every wish with a number five i'm gonna say something about else about that in a second okay be fire stand up for yourself <laughs> yes definitely garden something lovely will grow from this oh my gosh ain't that the truth something lovely will grow from this and with this 15 breaking down to a six and six representing a uh, victory and success throne your potential is endless and then feast slow down and celebrate yourself this is the energy you're going to be in within the next six months and you're going to be like shaking off this residual energy of cobwebs always make me think about residual energy that's kind of stuck to you or a situation that you're trying to get through and i know it's not it's not easy it's just it's a lot easier said than done definitely I get in moods like that all the time. Okay, and what helps me is uh, hemi-sync meditations. So, that might help you guys. I mean, it helps, you know. <laughs> I got to do other stuff, too. I just got to do all kind of different stuff. All right, I'm prone to... Um, I'm prone to anxiety, depression, and stuff like that. So, I understand. Okay, so Spirit Guardian of Spring, activation number 36, which is a nine. You're, it's like this cycle is coming to this point. There's some kind of cycle in your life that's getting to a point where I think you're about ready. You're about ready to end it if you're not already. Um, something here started in the spring. Maybe it was like Spirit working behind the scenes. Okay, it's time for you to have some fun here. Because it seems like, you know, this situation has been weighing on you for a while and stressing you out for a while now. <clears throat> All right. So now what was that other card? I was, I was going to say something else about, I guess I wasn't supposed to, because I forgot to do it. Patience. I don't know. I feel like you've had a lot of patience. But as far as patience goes, though, this is another number nine. So you could be seeing 999. Nine, nine. But um, this patience card, patience makes me think of Sagittarius because of the temperance card. But, yeah, I mean, having patience is always good. Unless it's you having patience with somebody who keeps on putting you in this state of mind that's lowering your your vibration or making you you know feel like crap making you sad cry angry all this stuff you should not have you know the pay so much patience with this person that it starts making you sick and i'm seeing that here not, maybe not literally sick but drained okay going with the flow meandering pathway flow you're like this wizard energy here another number 24 which is another number six go with the flow and like as in go with the flow um as in follow the signs follow the signs that you're getting whatever this is going on you've been getting the signs because i'm seeing that you've been getting the signs like this card here with the uh this is like your your angels and ancestors like trying to put downloads in your head like this is go this is what's really going on. This is what's really going on, but you you know have a blindfold on, which we all do that sometimes because we love people and you know and maybe people even do that with us sometimes. Um like with the blindfold like, I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to deal with it. And then, bam, the universe brings in something that just, it's like, okay, they're not going to, you know, they're not going to end this situation. So, and it's at this point, it's making them sick. The four swords don't always mean that, but in this, in this reading, it does. And so something happens, something happens to kind of knock 
whoever this is that's been um screwing with your energy your emotions or whatever it's like your spirit team burst out of the sky and knocks their ass off the pedestal or something y'all that's what i'm getting so i hope that helped or resonated in some way love you guys please leave me an emoji in the comments like subscribe and follow whichever platform this is on okay bye